morning, PHS. I'm Devin Gritton, and with me today is the almighty Gracie Hallam. Thanks, Devin. It's great to be here. Stay tuned, everyone. PTV starts right now. Off with our SRT meetings, members of the Global Discussion Club will be meeting in room 146. Then, after school, robotics will meet in room 141, and the winner wins will be meeting in the music wing. At 4.30 sharp, the speech and debate team will be boarding the bus to head to Indianapolis for the IHS FA State Speech Tournament. Good luck, guys! Also going on tonight is the annual team banquet for the swim and dive team in the cafeteria starting at 5.30. The PHS Prom Club will be having a rummage sale on Saturday, March 18th from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. right here at PHS. If you have any items you might like to donate towards the rummage sale, please contact Ms. Emmonson, Ms. Colling, Ms. Weaver, Ms. Marquette, Ms. Watson, or Ms. Dorr. All of them are junior class sponsors. Any one of them will be able to help you out. PHS Theater Department is putting on their winter play, Transylvania, on Friday, March 17th and Saturday, March 18th at 7 p.m., both evenings in the PHS Auditorium. The play is open to the public. Audience members of all ages are welcome to come and watch the comedy of teenage monsters attending Transylvania High School. Doors open at 6.30 p.m. for general seating. Tickets are $6.00. PHS Theater Arts 1, Theater Arts 2, acting and stage crew classes are all working hard on this play. Please think about coming to one of the two performances. Well, PHS, as you guys know, the spring season is rolling around. You know what that means. Spring break. Two whole weeks of spring break, March 27th through April 7th. Are you going on a trip, staying home, or traveling the world? PTV would love to know where you're heading and what you'll be doing. Just hashtag at hashtag PTV at PHS this spring break while posting your pictures on social media. And we'd love to share some of your pictures on our show when you get back. It's a fun and exciting way for you to engage with us and show us what you guys are doing. So in order to do this, tag us or hashtag us at PTV at PHS. During spring break, PHS will be holding intercession for students whose grades might not be up to par. Intercession will be held at PHS during the first week of our break from March 27th through the 30th. Each of the three days will last six hours and lunch will be provided for those who attend. Hours of intercession classes will be 8 a.m. until 1 p.m. Subjects where students can get help on boosting grades are the core 40 subjects such as English, Science, Math, and Social Studies. Reminder. Pick up for the 5th Annual Plymouth Prom Chicken Noodle Carryout Dinner Fundraiser is this Friday, March 10th, from 3.30 p.m. to 6.30 p.m. You've had to have already purchased a ticket to purchase, so this reminder is for people who need to pick up your order. The carryout pickup is in the Plymouth High School Circle Drive by the front doors. Drive-up service is available. Oh, and by the way, the money raised will be used to buy extra prom stuff such as decorations, supplies, food, and, prize, and door prizes for after prom. Your cap and gown pickup will be on Wednesday, March 22nd in the North Lobby across from the Varsity Gym from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. Make sure you make time to pick up all these essential items so you can walk down the aisle this year with your class. This Friday, our grading period will be coming to an end, so be ready to receive your report card in two weeks during Homeroom on March 21st. Shout out to Mercedes Bastardo, who is part of our PTV marketing crew, who has made this graphic for us. Moving on to PTV Sports, let's take a look at this sports lineup this week. Look like, looks like our teams are pretty much taking a break until Saturday. That's when the girls and boys track teams will be traveling to Marion, Indiana for their meet at Indian Wesleyan University at 10 a.m. Did you enjoy our PTV Super Bowl contest? Well, due to a high demand of people wanting to take part, PTV will be having another sports contest. Put first, we need 50 people to sign up. This contest will, will yield our biggest prize to date. PTV Sports will be having their first ever very own March Madness Bracket Contest where the winner will receive $50 gift card 
to Buffalo Wild Wings. But in order to host the contest, we need 50 students and staff members here at PHS to sign up. Make sure your name for your entry, your first name and last name, so we can identify you. To join the contest, go to the bracketchallenge.ncaa.com and search for the group P PTV March Madness with the password PTV. The website is currently unblocked, but if it is blocked in the future, you will have to join on another device. Again, we need 50 PHS combination of students and teachers to join the group and able to offer the winning prize, a $50 gift card to Buffalo Wild Wings. All right, guys, it's almost that time of the show, PTV Trivia Time. But before the big question, let's recap the previous PTV Trivia question. This video was captured by PTV photojournalist Juan Garcia. He was there when Mr. Wolf's room cashed in on their delicious props, a huge bag of popcorn, for winning last week's trivia question. The question was, by the way, what year was the first Academy Awards held? The answer was 1929. Here we go, everyone. PHS is everyone's favorite time of the show. Trivia time. We have to make a slight change to our answering process. This week we've changed our email. It's now phsmarketing at plymouth.k12.in.us. Let's get on to this week's question. We, what are the three movies with the most Oscar wins? If you know the answer, email us at phsmarketing at plymouth.k12.in.us. Again, the question is, what are the three movies with the most Oscar wins? Email us at phsmarketing at plymouth.k12.in.us. And at 10.55, we'll pick a random winner to win our awesome prize this week. Uh, oh, and one thing we need to note, the, teacher mu like the answer must come from the teacher's email. So make sure your teacher is playing along for your class to win. Well, it's almost that time to change our clocks. Daylight savings time for 2017 in Indiana will start at 2 a.m. this Sunday, March 12th, which means we all get gypped in an hour of our weekend. Time will fall backwards an hour in November. Turning now to what's on the lunch menu today, we'll be having chicken alfredo, broccoli, the fruit and vegetable bar, and some delicious garlic bread sticks. Well, that's all we have for you guys today. Until next time, I'm Devin Gritton. I'm Gracie Hollum. Stay tuned next week for the latest and greatest in PTV news. We messed up, messed up. Of course she here. did. Okay, stand by. Okay. Is it, is it working? Yeah. Five, Five, four, four three, three, two, one. Well, that's all we have for you guys today. Until next time, I'm Devin Gritton. And I'm Gracie Hollum. Stay tuned next week for the latest and greatest in PTV news and check out who our next guest anchor will be. If you want to know or you want to be a part of our show, just email our teacher, Judy Likowski, via email. Have a wonderful rest of the day and go Pilgrims. Woo!